This all-girls boarding school in Kajiado, Kenya, operates with little access to basic services. The 250 high school students here barely have access to lights, let alone essential learning tools like computers. It's a boarding facility for girls from Form 1 to Form 4. Uh, they are completely off-grid and accessibility is like way, way far. We have a challenge of electricity. We are not connected to the national grid. In classes, the students are complaining of eye problems. We are not able to use IT in class, like uh, tablets, and we also have a problem with the uh, internet connectivity. We can use the generator, but the cost of fuel is too high, it's unsustainable. An engineering team from University of Texas at Austin joined Give Power for a second time to build another solar microgrid and power the school full of incredible teachers and students. The aspirations are really high. I think the education is great. The teachers are amazing. What I'm excited about is the fact that they'll have power. They won't have to worry about it. I know it's easy for us to say, let's go green, just install solar panels. So much goes into it that people don't really think about. We've been doing digging, electrical work, putting together solar panels, and it's been several days of doing work. I have a blister to prove that I'm not lazy. <laughs> In addition to installing a new microgrid, the engineering team had an opportunity to visit a nearby Give Power solar water farm and even work with Give Power to optimize its production. Give Power's work is very unique. It starts from a very solid technical basis. If the enabling tech was not there, it would not have led to all this impact. And I think many of the students are thinking what kind of impact I want to have and do more with international development uh, and contribute some of their expertise to it. They've given us hope that uh, we can achieve what we are not able to achieve because of the limitation we had. They've also given students the confidence and they believe it will improve their service team. It makes me happy to know that like now they have computers, they are connected. I'll hope to become an engineer, a chemical engineer. They've given me more than I could ever give them. I think I will always remember how brilliant they are. This is truly like a once in a lifetime experience for a lot of us, especially the students. I think the values that they gave to us and the things that they taught me especially, I'm really gonna take with me for a long time. My heart is so full. I just feel so like fulfilled and grateful and blessed. 